These are the massive 3D printers, which are literally doing the job of more than a dozen construction workers. As I said, we've seen one-offs before on 3D printed homes, but never anything like this. They're squeezing out homes at a rate of one every two weeks. 3D printed homes in the first ever full-scale 3D community from a national home builder, Lennar. I mean, this is the first 100 homes, but we expect to be able to bring this to scale. And at scale, we really bring cycle times down and we also bring costs down. Lennar is partnering with Icon, which has printed a half dozen homes here in Texas and in Mexico, but nothing like this. This system is designed to operate 24 hours a day so that as you look out at the whole community, this is a factory. It's a portable factory that we brought here with a fleet of printers. To build 100 homes ranging from 1,500 to 2,100 square feet and starting in the mid $400,000 range. We select the print job that we want. We press print. <laughs> And right now, it only takes about three people per home to build the wall systems that include mechanical, electrical, and plumbing. And as the technology improves... I think the sort of holy grail is where one person can watch a dozen systems. So not only is it incredibly efficient to build these homes, they are incredibly sturdy because they're made out of solid concrete. That makes them weather resilient, wind resistant, water resistant, termite resistant, mold resistant. And everybody asks me, Brian, what does it feel like? It feels like concrete corduroy. But you can literally tell the printer to do anything you want, whether it's the kitchen island or where to put the outlets. You just put it into the laptop and it prints what you want. So. I have to say, I do think what they're doing here on this scale could be construction of the future. Brian? Really cool. I mean, it, it kind of looks like taffy, like you're living in a, a taffy <laughs> home, but I, I guess it's stronger than that. Uh, is there? A, we've been talking about inflation all day, Diana, so I'm sorry to throw this on you. Is there an inflationary aspect to this? I mean, I, I imagine those materials are pretty, pretty commodity price sensitive. Well, absolutely. Look, it's cement and concrete, and so it's going to be cheaper in the building process, anywhere from 10 to 30 times cheaper. Now, these homes are starting in the 400, mid $400,000 range, anywhere from three to four bedrooms, two to three bathrooms. They are more expensive because Lennar is putting all kinds of high-end fixtures into them, solar on the roof. They're going to do high-end cabinets. But a home like this could be anywhere from 10 to 30 percent cheaper than a comparable constructed home. And on the labor side, of course, you're doing it two to three times faster with really just two or three guys on each home. Wow. That, that is something else. And the future is here. Diana Olick, very cool. It is. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. All right, still ahead. Lots more on this massive market rally. What names are the best set up to ride this move even higher? We have got some names for you with the Dow up big, but the NASDAQ up 6%.